Yeah, man. <clears throat> Bless up to everybody, you see me? Yeah. You don't know the thing set to you know. First, I do this thing, you see it? I'm get that thing in focus. Like a camera. Mm -hmm. First, I do this YouTube thing, you see me? I try to start up a little business. You know? Because we as black people, we have to have ambition, you know? You understand? Because some of us feel like we're too entitled. Yeah, because we claim, say, the slavery thing and, you know? We don't nah deny none of that. We don't know, say, all that happened. Facts, historical facts. You see me? But we cannot get up every day blaming the colonists, as what we call them, the colonizers, as what we call them, you know? We have to do what in our power to make our destiny be in our hands. See? And not up to people who, you know, people who we claim, say, have the power over it. Right? First topic I have to discuss. Because you want know, I get tired to see it. And it's a nine no bum buck. You see me? Yeah, very annoying. Sorry for the bad word and them things. Because you don't know. I try to keep it professional. Yo, this youth here. What him name? Marvin. Or something like that. I don't know where this youth are from now. The only thing I see this youth upon is YouTube. Every time I turn on my, my YouTube, because I live in New York still. Is it? I'm on a yard man, street. Not no change. Still a chip, been a chip. We know all I slang them, we know everything we are going. But we just try to keep it professional. Right? This youth here now. See if we can get that thing here. Yeah. Focus this thing. Yeah, this youth, you know, Marvin the Beast. I me mean, everybody call him. Yo, we don't need to leave the youth alone. I mean, no enough I want to start saying. Yeah, defend whatever I want to call him. Because I want to say my fuck. That's what I want to say. You, know. you see me? I don't want nothing about that. Right? But we don't need to leave the youth alone. And I can't tell you that we don't need to do it neither. Because everybody has their own big people. With their own mind. But we don't need to look in on ourselves. Right? And figure say, what is it a benefit to you? You know? Which part that I put on you? We don't get out of it. Somebody appear when we do it. And that may I try to figure out. Because my new feeds flood with this thing. And I decide to say, yo, I have to say something about it. And when I come and say, I have no illiteracy. Or go on like we're too eloquent. And I use a bag of big words. You see what I say? I break it down in a yard man terms. And I say, yard people illiterate neither. Because I know no love jump to conclusion. You know? As when I hear a thing, when I edit it up. And put it out, uno want put it. But uno can't fix me. So I'm in a broke down. You hear that? But anyway. <laughs> Yo. The youth is a try to make a life for himself, Rasta. You see me? The youth is a try to elevate himself with the craft where. The gift for him same of. Cause he wanna him say my dancer. Me a old school. You see me I say me a from the seventies. Yeah. Big one thing. But him say my dancer. So he wa a film craft that. A film mode that. For. Use the means. Where him of for elevate for himself. You know, which in there is other means to do it. But a fame style, a fame swag that say so here. We have to just give him props. Cause I do him thing. 
and who forget to take care of me, know that he must have take care of him woman because I see him and him woman on the tube all the while what them say, Nikisha and him woman that so the man have him woman to them I turn on the YouTube I say a new feed pop up <laughs> I say yo you know pride parade a foreign right there uh, uh, him there in Canada, why him there in Canada? on Pride Parade weekend. Watch it now. Me work on Manhattan. As one of Jamaicans would have want to say, Gallant. But I don't go play illiterate. No blood. Hey, listen, my man. No word no name Gallant. No fix me. Manhattan the place name. You understand? So, it's like, me work on Manhattan. Right? From Pride Parade weekend, I'm gonna tell you this. And this is a real meds. See? I see some things. Pride Parade weekend. Where if I did a Jamaica, I would take a taxi or jump in my car and drive go somewhere else. I wouldn't stay up on the location. But since me live a foreign, I learn what them call tolerance. You see? The grandmother ever tell you a thing where say soup is in the market, beef is in the bone. What don't concern dirty nigga leave it alone? Alright. I tell you something. Say a foreign. If you ever see one of them and try like you want to disrespect them in any way, any means necessary, trust me, you're going to pay for it. You can't hide a foreign. Every corner you go, a camera there. There is no way for you to hide. If it takes you one million years, you are going to get catch. And you go pay a fee. You see me? You don't know. You see, as a yard man say, bow cat and can't tell you no fair fuck. I don't bow. No time. I mean, I think I could do it. Because I know my style. All of my people are my rasta. My father, my brother, my uncle, everybody are rasta. But you know, I'm a ball it. You see me? Because I wish part my work. You can't, they not going to allow you to they know them corporations and them with it. corporate, the thing set. You understand? So you want to leave the youth alone, man. Make the youth live him life. Because me I say, me work on one nothing. And something with me say, Saturday night. Friday, Saturday and Sunday night. Especially Sunday night. Because Sunday are the big march. Where you see woman, you know, but the woman them are mostly sodomite. But may I tell you something when me see, but you see, through me learn tolerance, I know say, you know, the people them country, you know, come from here, and you come here to make better for yourself and your family, you have to learn tolerance, leave them alone. And you know, the hunger way. It takes a bother you, or it bother you. I mean, it takes a bother your eyesight, them, because it's in your eyeball, them. You see what I say? So you see it in your eyeball, them, and you know, probably it cross your spirit. Probably your spirit get cross or whatever. You don't know the thing set. But the only way you take it up on your head, unless you are fish, too. You see me? That's the only way you take it up on your head. Are you insecure with yourself? Probably you feel safe then get too close to you, I get turned on or something like that. You see me? Yeah. I got a school up here. And two of my friends them are fish. Not really my friend them. But my school meet them. So you don't know we deal with them in a school. But out of school. 
just stay in your lane, you see me? But I set some ground rules. When I make them know, I say, listen to me now. I don't force my straightness by you. So I don't want you to force your culture upon me. See? Meaning, say, I don't want to hear about your sex life. And I don't want to hear about your boyfriend. I don't want to hear none of that. We can talk about schoolwork. I talk about some woman, you know? Because they have a whole heap of woman friend, you know? Don't get me wrong, you know? They have a whole heap of woman friend. <laughs> but you have to be careful which one of them woman friend. You see me? You try to talk to them. Because all of them are woman. They both look like. Yo, watch out. Watch out. Leave the youth alone. Yeah, as I said, I'm not going to say Jamaicans, Ill, Jamaicans illiterate, but most Jamaicans don't have the educational capacity past grade 6. Put it away there. Yeah. I may be honest with you. And if you don't want to be honest with yourself, you don't know that too. See? So, being a person who know where you stand for and a person who know your morals and your ethics you don't really have to have an education to have morals and ethics you know. but you have to have an education to know which part you want to reach in your life and to attain certain goals you have to have an education to get in a certain group You see what I say? Yeah, so when I say most Jamaicans are literate, I don't want to talk about it. So I don't want to take this and put no little idiot title upon my thing and splice up my thing. Because remember, it's copyright. So now we pay for it too. So careful. Because I say enough of them vloggers here. Them vloggers here, them. Who no fuck up? Yeah, no for who no. See me? I only for them miss a man, but here we are going now. We are trying to keep this thing professional. I don't have three call no name in it. But if a man take up this pan in head, I don't have to pay for it. Remember me telling you, I don't have to pay for it, so careful. See? What I really come to talk about and what I really build this channel around is life. That's what it's, this channel is going to be based upon. That's what this channel is going to be built around. This channel ain't going to be built around all your controversy. You know, because we are showing us how we can do it though. Because I saw you have to do it when you're there out there in a the corporate. See? Because most of the people, we don't have a stereotype. I don't have a group, we don't put people in a. You see what I'm saying? Like, Put it away. I have one all of my ink them. I ink up from Jamaica. See? I don't have a group who want to try to mix people in you know? Because if you see me out of the road in my marina right now, I don't go say, oh, he's a thug, he's a gangster, he's a gangbanger, all that shit. When I've never been in a gang before. You know, everybody have them past. But I'm not going to get into that. Leave that alone. Yeah. Everybody have them past still, but. I tell you straight, I ain't no gangbanger. Never been in a gang. I've always been by myself. Always been a soldier. Always been a rebel. I always stand for the right thing. Low the wrong. Take the right turn. Low the wrong. You see me? But I'm not going to sit down here and act like I'm perfect still. Far from it. Far from it. Yeah, but I don't feel leave the youth alone, man. I don't defend him still because I don't know nothing about him. You know? But you are now. I'm going to be brutally honest with you. Know? 
See? If the youth are fish, as we want to say, supposedly, allegedly, right? If he swings, if he bats for the other team, right? What's that benefiting you to put him down, to, to, to be trying to put him down and all that? What are you getting from it? What are you gaining? Where's that going to put you in life? How much, that, how much is that going to put in your bank account? You know, most of y'all that's talking, how big is your bank account anyway? I don't want to know. I'm just, I'm just putting it out there that's a, you know, let you know I'm thinking about it. Like, why y'all just try to put this nigga down like that? You understand? And you want know, Mr. Wally, I think on the tube. I mean, no, say I pay on a pay enough people for come set things about the youth, you know. Because it's enough, I want enough, I want a wicked, no, but hey, you see, you know. No found a wicked. I tell me, I tell you, but you are now. You stand for something or you fall for anything, you know. You see me? But everybody have a different mindset. And I can't tell you for a fact. Anybody try to, you know, flip the script. I'm going to just roll up, just pull up. And that ain't no joke. Because, listen, the only thing you own in this life, no matter, how many, no matter how much material you got or whatever, the only thing you own in this life is your name. So you got to protect that name. You got to defend that name. Your name is your reputation. You protect that with your life. So don't mess with my reputation. On my kid's bread or my wife's bread and think that I'm just gonna lay over and play dead. I ain't no possum. And I ain't no saint either. I'm far from it. Cause we all human beings, none of we're not perfect. We all have anger issues. Some of we might know how to compress it and subdue it so it not come upon the surface. But we all got a little bit of anger issues. No matter how you're going to try to deny it or whatever. See? Oh, uh, you are going now. It, it hurt me. The reason why it hurt me because the youth are trying. The youth just do them thing. You see? It? The youth just do them thing. From me, they are Jamaica, Passa Passa. I rock for what I come from. You know. If you know what I know. You know. I live on road. See me? The whole works. Flour mill. You see me? Out of east. Yeah. All of you. Out of Europe. This, uh, fully governed. Dunkirk. Whole heap of people may have a Dunkirk. Enough people may have a mountain view too. See me? Top range. 163. Jarrett Lane. Whole works. Yeah. So nobody feel you say everybody who can punk out. You see it? As I said, the whole point of this thing is even if the youth I do well no claim say I do, if him a fish you wanna say, whether that benefit none of you if you try to put down the youth. Lord the man make him live him life, you know God. You see it? Watch it. Only God can judge me. None of you can judge me. You can't even judge on yourself. Because if you don't judge on yourself, you don't get judgment. Because you see, if night could have turned to day, and when enough of you don't do back a closed door, come out to light, trust me, you don't even have to run when either. You don't kill on yourself. Leave the youth alone and make the man live him life. And stop sending threat to people for the internet. Don't get up every day and threaten people for the internet. You know, stupid. Hey, that's called dry snitching, niggas. Y'all snitching on yourselves. Ooh, I'm a. You know, y'all threatening people. I'm a gonna do this and I'm a gonna do that and do this and whatever. Hey, listen, my man. The loudest ones are always the punks. 
They're always the punks, the loudest ones. Right? And for me personally, I ain't here to threaten nobody. I'm just here to promote my YouTube channel. You see me? Basically, on my channel, we're going to be talking about maths. You know, mathematics. You know, we get deep in it. We talk about some science, you know, some earth science. Stuff like that. I don't talk about science when we Jamaican call science. I talk about like science, like geology, oceanology, and all that kind of stuff. You understand what I'm saying? I talk about some social study, yeah? Some Jamaican history, history of the world, history of the universe, some American history, same way. Because, yeah, I say, American history is very fascinating. When me did the back of Jamaica, I say, yo, I don't want to come to America because the stories that I hear about America. But since me there and me get my knowledge with me of American history fascinating, man. If you know the full history back of it. I mean, I talk about the Rastaman history. Whether, you know, because everybody has for them way to theorize a thing or a subject to try to justify the way that they trying to put it across. But that's not always facts. Facts is history. That's facts. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So the channel is basically about mathematics, social studies, science, you know, some chemistry. It's going to be an educational channel. It ain't going to be none of this hype. Hype thing and because this hype thing on our run down. The reason why y'all trying to get into this hype is to wear the Gucci or the Louis V or the Louis Boutin, you know, or the Fendi or the Prada or you know, the Christina Milian and all that kind of stuff. But all that stuff means nothing. Simplicity. That me use for survive. Since I call Angie. You have to know how to live with nothing. If you can appreciate something. So most of y'all never really had nothing. Which is not your fault. Because in Jamaica there's not a lot of opportunities for you to achieve something. So you got, you, you know, you got to hustle. Sell your bog juice, yes sir. Sell your jerk chicken. But you're not really making the money out of that for say yo. Yeah, you know, like you're financially stable. So don't get me wrong, the opportunity does not dead. So that, that me mean when I say when you're not really used to nothing. Some. So don't twist my words. Some. Not all. Some born with gold spoon in their mouth. So make it out of the ghetto by way of music. <clears throat> you understand? <coughs> yeah. But the rest were never so fortunate for make it out. It's like a crab in a barrel a crab in a barrel mentality. You see me? I'm a wish good for everyone. Once you now bring your lifestyle to me, or mention your lifestyle to me, do anything you want to do. Now have nothing to do with me. What means something to me and my wife and my daughter? Them. That means something to me. And right now, I not even live for myself. I live for my people, my family. And them I live for. Because I know say if I keep up certain fuckery, what heap of people like a ball? Is it? Yeah. Whole heap of people are going to miss me because whole heap of people live for you. Big woman thing. Yeah, man. Whole heap. So you see right now, that we are going to talk about on the channel basically still. Some educational stuff. None of this like a animosity where you don't love. Because you don't love, you don't love controversy, you know. You don't love mix up, you know. Yeah, man. Because I follow it on YouTube from what you're on. No for one, love mix up. 
foot a hype. You are one of them. You are not real. I can't tell you that. And you can't talk me in my mouth. You have an extra raster one on the gram. And on the tube and on the book. I get tired to see him on my views them too. One name Jack Yor. Yo, if you look on the back of him neck, you see made in China. Tell me, I tell you. I should relax them and hide it because I can't see it. But made in China right around them, man. Yeah, man. Fake. Get caught up in a vanity and material. Just start with a little money. Have a couple million and feel like say. You may say, man. Millions are nothing, man. <laughs> At least that. You see me? But we try to live simple. And try to make something out of yourself. And stop trying to put down people. And drag people name through the gutter cause. Father God not sleeping. Father God not sleeping. And the moment no found arise for a fall. Yeah. Yeah man. So take it how you want take it. I'm not going to try to say nothing more about that topic. I'm just going to introduce my channel to you. Introduce what I see in my face every day. Which is this Marvin Youth. And I see it on the youth, you know, the youth stress out. You know, because the name I get dragged through the mud, all anger. If you look on the, when the man attack, you can see it, the man stress out. That's it. Yeah. So that will come for talk about. Introduce my channel and tell the whole on a little hypocrite and parasite for loud man. You see me? You don't have to listen to what I say. You don't know. have to listen to what I say. But you see, the universe have a way to make things reach you. When you feel your peace and safety and sudden destruction. You see me? Yeah, man. The universe have a way to turn back things to you. you know. And you see when your judgment has come, your judgment has come seven times hotter than the one where you put out. Because you invest your energy in a bad energy. And negativity breed negativity. You see me? Two negative plus a negative. You get a positive. So you see all the negative what we see when I put out. I am burning out with some negative words, but you see behind that, at the end of my statement, it's going to be positive because I'm going to look in on myself and realize say, a foolishness and I keep up and I don't benefit nothing from it. When you youth them probably not have breakfast, you know? When you probably don't have a job, when you see if a person asks you, what, or where do you see yourself in 10 years? I don't know how y'all going to answer that question. Because if you ain't financially stable, you're going to always, always be scraping the bottom of the barrel. So, just looking on yourself and read. Read a lot. Very helpful. You see me? Big up on yourself, man. So upload some more video. So we can talk about some serious topic. So something substantial for your brain. Some brain food. I'm mean, not talking about marijuana. I'm mean, not talking about ganja. I'm mean, talking about brain food. Knowledge. Yeah. When we say knowledge, we're not going to talk about everything still. You know? It's a certain topic. You have to leave it alone. Certain things you have to know. What you say. Or don't say nothing at all. Because if you word it wrong. If your grammar is off. You're going to pay for it. You see me? Yeah man so. I was so still. But just go and big up on yourself. And just look into it myself still. And say what not benefit. You know. What not benefit from dragging this youth name through the mud. And through the gutter and the trenches. And I got realize that I benefit nothing from it. 
See? Just look into that and try to uplift on yourself. Yeah, man, an upliftment to say, man. Try to uplift on yourself and on a family, man. So people can proud down. Know. Because this thing when I say, no found no, I glorify this badness. You hear me? I said, no found no bad. I don't know nothing about badness. Me am from the 70s, so I tell you now. I don't know bad. I don't just act bad. I don't know how I just smell bad. But I don't know bad. Yeah. Yeah. So just look into that. Leave badness alone. Try to live good. Live good with everybody. Show love. Love is what it's all about. Before me left, I tell you nothing. You say most Jamaican would have never look upon a man and say, Yo, my brother, I love you, you know, my brother. You yeah, my brother, you know. Why you know, can't why you know, do it? Because I'm not going to say, Yo, I'm a bad man. If you look upon a man, oh, but I tell no man say I love them. You mad? I'm a bad man. Yo, yo. You know, too insecure. When I move like Jack you are. <laughs> when you're insecure, that's our problem. See me? Show love. Read in the Bible. Read the Bible a lot. Appreciate nature. Appreciate the universe. You understand what I say? Those are the things where you have to put your energy into. And I guarantee you. Nothing but good gonna come from it. You understand? Y'all have a good day, man. One love. Blessings. Peace. Unity. That's the thing, that.